Welcome to the E Sprinter. This is the newest Mercedes Benz electric van of very, very sizable proportions. And we arrive at a spot that you probably know if you've seen earlier videos the Fastnet Tafelbergweg station. Here we go. So let's see. Six percent. Welcome to the show. Ta da! And what I really like. Boom, you press the bottom one and they open together. It's these kind of tricks that make me happy that there's still engineers thinking about these things. After showing the travel card plug to Fastnet, here we go. It flashes because I chose it. Let's put it in. And here the immediate lock, the reading of the charger it takes eight seconds to figure out that it that, that it's starting at six percent. So the first prediction says half an hour to a full charge, 33 minutes. Let's see what's real. Battery should be pretty warm because I tried to uh, get quite some power in on the highway. Let's see. Yes, it starts. I will show you the side of the charger. We are above 50 already. I never had that before with only 6% in there. So my technique to try and heat up the battery seems to have worked quite a bit because it started much lower on earlier sessions so hopefully this will be my best fast charging session with the e sprinter Nearly 60 kilowatts after less than four minutes of charging because charging didn't start when the time started to run Let's see where we get and the car is showing 58 So it seems to be one kilowatt charging loss Would be interesting I found the same kind of reading on the EQC before The ramp up is starting. You could see that it wanted to go to 80 kilowatts already. And it will get there. And it will go over. And it will go up and up and up. It's too bad that they took away Fastnet did a firmware upgrade. Took away the numbers showing amps and volts, which is too bad. It's really busy. Look, the Audi already left. Here we go. We crossed the 80 kilowatt barrier. And now it's time to fly. I really hope that the Mercedes will show its true power here. Because imagine if it continues at this speed till over 90%, which is what I'm hoping. This charging curve could be amazing. 
50% within 20 minutes. 19 minutes from 6% to 50%. 19 minutes, that's amazing. I really like it. It's time to shine for the Mercedes E Sprinter. Just look at this. 59%, 85 kilowatts. Waiting to get to 60%. It took less than four minutes from 50 to 60%. Yes. And it's still ramping up. I can hardly keep track. 87 kilowatts now. 71%. I came from 6%. So 26 minutes is completely realistic to charge from 6 to 70% with the e-sprinter. If you emptied the battery like I did and you just did some work, you will be okay. Oh yes, oh yes, it's gonna be possible or at least nearly possible to charge 6 to 80% in half an hour. One happy camper over here, I can tell you that. The e-sprinter. my scooter comfortable lights isolation lots of space and this guy over there oh it didn't cl close right there we are 29 minutes, 6 to 80 percent. 29 minutes. The Mercedes E Sprinter, everybody. This is the van to get if you want fast charging. This charging curve is really impressive. It makes me think of the e tron. I mean, clearly the battery is smaller, but especially considering that battery size. This curve, this charging curve, I'm amazed. Nearly hitting 90 kilowatts and we are above 80% already. It is very impressive. You can see the charging loss around one and a half kilowatts. Yes, yes. 66 to 90 percent in 32 minutes and a little bit. 6 to 90 percent in a good half hour. That is time for a coffee and a sandwich. And you're back on track with a nearly full battery. I'm amazed by the E Sprinter charging curve. Yes. Just look at this charging curve. 6 to 96 percent so 90 percent added 43 kilowatt hours in 34 minutes oh yes the e sprinter is one you can use to fast charge all day every day absolutely at fastnet for example and just look at the great plug location Cable length at Fastnet, never an issue. Really, really comfortable. 98%. Can I do a full charge? Should I do a full charge? I'm gonna try and see what happens because this is amazing.
It stopped. It stopped. 37 minutes to 100%. Holy heavens, e sprinter. Would it show range already? Let's see. If I try to start it, even though the cable is still connected, no range prediction. But 100%. Welcome, welcome a hundred percent. There's the range prediction, 146. And if I change to comfort mode, 137. And it warns me that the cable is still connected. Yeah. So what I love about the Mercedes, you press the button, it unlocks. Put back the car, yeah, put back the plug. And these details, I love details like this. I just press the top one and they both shut. That is Mercedes cleverness. 